Decent couple of uh, sets though to start for John Duffy's Lee Centurions. And that's going to turn Elliot Keir around and the Red Devils fullback is wrapped up and he's going to be dumped behind his own goal. People have certainly started bright. Very bright start and here they come again into the line. Lovely quick hands and there are options left and right. It's going to be the winger to score the first one. Matty Russell just clung on to his touch line. Yelled for the ball and touchdown and Lee have the points that their start deserved. They leave 4-0 with a kick to come. Who is it then? Ollie Roberts? Yeah, how he took that a point blank range. Shouldn't have been yeah, anywhere near yeah. it. Here comes Salford over the line. Is he held up? Yes, he is. See who finds Lolla here has a little think and then gives it to Brown there's loads of room on the far side steps through and dabs past the fullback and Salford draw level and that had been coming yeah smart play from uh, from Kevin Brown he's seen the, the lead defence was, was stood still just picked a defender 2 on 1 the Barton Bridge end the M60 end as we look on high on the gantry oh that was a very difficult take round the ankles he took it well falling into the line well twice they've attacked the line and twice they've scored and out of nowhere Lee have the lead back and it's Thornley's score. That was a great take as well. Atkin waits to give the ball to Brown on his own. Kevin Brown steps through and reeling in the ears Kevin Brown steps and Salford have the lead back. Great play there from uh, from Brown. He's seen the, the, the lead defence was, was stood still in this, uh, in this lead side. Everybody's looking back for... for Oh, and it's... Well, it's gone backwards and it's going to be a foot race. This is going to be play on. And I don't think he's going to be caught here. They're herring after him. All the way on his own. It's going to be a length of the field score. And with Lee attacking the line, it's Ken Seer who scores down the other end. And that could be the score that gives Salford daylight in this huge battle at the foot of the Betfred Super League. It was Lee's pressure. The ball came free. And Salford went the length of the pitch for Seo to score and extend their lead to 16-8 with a kick to come. Through an entire kind of pre-season training drill on his own, including the, ble the dreaded bleep test out. And oh, blimey, he was blowing. Oh. And here comes Livette for Salford. Oh, and they give the ball to Aaron. Brown's going to run in his second. And that's the try, I think, that's going to win it for Salford. And it's the old-timer, Kevin Brown, in support with his second of the game to give... What is going to be a crucial two points and a first win of the season to the Salford Red Devils who lead now 22 points to eight with a kick to come. Inu and Sio over on the far side. Lolly here again finds Brown who's on a hat-trick. Atkin and Levette. Oh and he's on his own and then inside. Oh that's brilliant from Salford. Great Wonderful two, try. Great two on carry there from uh, from Harvey Levet. He looked outside, seen pushed through the line, showed the dummy and uh, great support from Chris Atkin on the inside as, as, as all good nines do. But you just see the difference there, Salford pushing through the line in numbers, running with intent. That's been the difference for me. You sense if they want another, we'll probably get it here because Lee's heads have gone. Brown. There we go. Big gap. And Levet will be the beneficiary and it's easy as a one, two, three. And the Red Devils are running right to the AJ Bell. They had another four, and it's 32-8, and it's another ugly Betfred Super League defeat, I'm afraid, for the Lee Centurions.